Okay, boys and girls, welcome to Wednesday. We're going to start with our social, social and emotional learning. Good morning. It is Wednesday. We've made it to Wednesday. We're halfway through the week. Let's listen to a beautiful day. This is your time to stand up and dance and get that sleepiness away. Whoops. There you go. Here we go. Rise up, children, celebrate. It's a wonderful world and a beautiful day. Hold a hand, swing and sway. It's a wonderful world and a beautiful day. Birds are, Birds are flying. Squirrels are climbing. Squirrels are climbing. Trees are swaying. Trees are swaying. Children are playing. Children are playing. Runners are running. Runners are running. Hearts are thumping. Hearts are thumping. Dances are bopping. Rabbits are hopping. Rabbits are hopping. Rise up, children, celebrate. It's, it's a wonderful, wonderful world and a beautiful day. Hold a hand, swing and sway. It's a wonderful world and a beautiful day. Buses are driving. Buses are driving. Jets are flying. Guitars are strumming. Guitars are strumming. Friends are hugging. Friends are hugging. Tails are wagging. Tails are wagging. Hands are clapping. Hands are clapping. Fishies are swishing. Fishies are swishing. Mommies are kissing. Mommies are kissing. Rise up, children, celebrate. It's a wonderful world and a beautiful day. Hold a hand, swing and sway. It's a wonderful world and a beautiful day. Feel the love and life every place. So rise up, children, celebrate. It's a wonderful world. Thank you, boys and girls. That was a wonderful song today. Okay, I'm glad to see that you are here and that we have our supplies today. We're going to sit where we can focus. When the music stops, we know that we sit down. We're dressed for school. And remember, we're not eating our breakfast right now. And we're not drinking like sugary drinks. But we can have water nearby if we need it. Remember that we stay on mute. We are going to talk about how are you feeling today. Are you happy, sad, surprised, excited, angry, or tired? Show me your beautiful faces. Let's see how you feel today. I see some tired faces. I see some angry faces. I see some happy faces. I love all your faces. And remember, if you need to use the restroom, you quietly go to the restroom and you come back. Okay, here we go. We're going to learn about anger and what that feels. And we were talking about our story yesterday where the character was mad. So we're going to talk about anger and what makes us angry. And you can go to our Epic School account and you can read this book. Here we go. Let's read Anger.
The computer is slow today. Please make sure that you're on mute. Mrs. Renaud has it in the library, so that's a good thing. Here it is. Okay, and it's a read to me book. And like I said, you can go back and it will read to you. How can you tell this boy is angry? When I'm angry, sometimes I get angry. The anger starts inside. My face feels hot. It gets red. When the anger comes out, I yell. I stamp my feet. Why I'm angry. Mom says I get angry when I'm tired. Dad says I get angry when I'm hungry. Usually I need a hug, a nap, or a snack. Why do you think these friends are fighting? Who makes me angry? Sometimes my friends make me angry. They don't share their toys. I get mad at my brothers, too. They tease me. It's not funny. Letting go of anger. Everyone gets angry sometimes. It's not fun to be angry, though. I take a deep breath and wait. Soon, my anger is all gone. I'm glad. Okay, good. We have finished the book. Now what we're going to do is we're going to get out our dry erase boards and we're going to draw on our dry erase board a time that you were angry, that you were really, really mad. And it's okay to feel angry, but it's also what you need to do if you feel angry is find a way to make yourself not feel angry. And lots of times, if you talk to a person, not yell and scream at a person, but if you talk to a person and say, what you did made me angry. Now, if it's something your brother and sister have done to make you angry, then you need to go to a parent or an adult to help if you need help to solve the situation. All right, so let's look at our dry erase board and I want you to draw a picture of a time you were angry. So my face to make angry, on my eyes, I have my eyes and I'm gonna draw like my eyebrows. See, those are angry eyebrows. It's just two little lines and you can already see that the face is angry. Some people draw a sad face to show that they're angry with the eyebrows and some people draw just a straight line. So both show angry. So make me an angry face and then draw when you were angry. What made you angry? Okay, and if you don't have your dry erase board, you can think of a time that you were angry or you can just get a piece of paper. So we're gonna draw a time that when we were angry. So go ahead and draw your picture. I'm gonna give you a couple, um, I'm gonna give you about 30 seconds because we're getting faster at this. And then we're going to share. So let's go ahead, draw your picture of when you were angry.
So draw a picture of when you were angry. Okay, if you're not finished with your picture, I'll let you finish it later. I'm going to share mine. What made me angry is my daughter Autumn has a cat and I had a beautiful vase of flowers and her cat knocked over my flowers. That made me angry. And the cat looked at me with a, what you going to do face? And I was like, oh my goodness. So I got upset with her cat and I got upset with Autumn. All right, on the count of three, one, two, three. Show me your pictures of your angry faces and what happened. Oh my goodness, look at those faces. Yep, I would be angry too if that happened. Yes. Nice faces, nice drawings. You guys are getting so good at drawing. Wow, look at that. I think I see some people who got angry with their brothers and sisters. Good job, boys and girls. Okay, what I would like you to do now, boys and girls, is please erase your boards and we will get ready for calendar. Great job.